It's a sunny day in Stuttgart, but it's January. And that is why this is coming out rather darkly. We're in this hall, got bright sunshine behind me, uh, winter sunshine, but and a clear day, but it's not cold at all. It's quite warm. Last week, I was sitting in my van, in my t-shirt, and um, without the heating on. So anyway, we've got here, uh, it's Mercedes 220D. It's been converted into a camper van by this company, uh, Curler, from the fort time in Germany called Sunvan. Cost 68,000 euros. It's got a 40 litre fridge. It's got um, uh, quite a good electrical two two uh, set up two batteries. It's got a um, charger. It's got um, all sorts of stuff. Okay, right. Um, looking at in here, so it's sort of, sort of a typical sort of VW conversion, although it's a Mercedes. How's that sound? <laughs> all right. So come let's see. Well, okay, that's that's really the same neat vehicle. But all right, um, it's a small vehicle. To, it is a car. Uh, no matter what you uh, the way you put it, it's a car with a bit of camping stuff on it. It's got a lot of camping stuff on. It. In fact, uh, uh, half the price is for camping materials. Right. So as you can see down here on the floor, we've got these guide rails, and that will allow the chairs to come forward or backwards or wherever you want them. Behind the chairs, you can see you've got this stacked uh, mattress. And that thing, when the chairs are in a down position, that, uh, that is put over the top of them and that turns into a bed. So one no longer has to sleep on the, uh, the chairs and you know, getting your, your thigh uh, hitting the uh, seat belt buckle. That's now a thing of the past. Well, it is if you have this fan, if you have another one, it may not be. Yeah, so you've got up here, got the the tent in the roof that comes down by pulling this thing down i won't do it right now as uh yeah, they don't like you sort of messing well in general i'm not saying on the stand but in, in general at the trade they don't like you sort of messing around with uh, their, 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 their kids right now the table uh, is variable position you know you move it along down here or whatever it's thanks to this guide rail it's the same fridge as I've got, only this one is actually uh, much smaller. And I bet somebody complains that the toilet is uh, next to the fridge in the comments below, so do write that down, that the toilet is next to the fridge, just in case anybody hasn't seen it. Right, question, where else would you put it? Um, you know, this is a rather small vehicle, it's a car, uh, it, and it's got all this equipment, so really it's got to go somewhere and that's as good a place as any in fact it's just about the only place I'll come around the other side so tambour doors storage there and below that we've got you see where the water is storage here as well currently top one in use now the, uh, many vans they put the uh, this side bar on here obviously it just block the entrance a bit but you can use it, of course still therefore for for storage um, so that might come in handy let's go on the outside Oh, these things here, I'll show you this. This is from a company called uh, Keep Going, which is near Gunsburg. I, put, I did a film of this in 2016, when I was on my way to Italy, I stopped over their place. And uh, that is, this is really very good. These things here, the company used to make seats, so, so, seat, and so this would be the seat of it. Then the, the curtain, they could actually use this material, which is extremely strong for uh, uh, things like the, of this nature. This will pull out, Pull that really a long way. This pan would easily go in there, for example. The only thing is stopping the strength could well be how it's been attached from here. 
anyway, I just make that point, it's a very good thing to actually use. Let's go into the back. Okay, right, so you can see the, the mattress here, which is behind the, the uh, screen. Show you another one. So this is on a, a Volkswagen base, this sun van here. It says Besser Schlafen, which means to sleep better. And that's once more because of the use of the uh, mattress that goes down over the chairs. There you go. So you can see how the mattress uh, is is here. You can also get these things here. These things slide out, makes it much easier to actually use. Right, I'll show you another one. A bit difficult, all these people around. Uh, so let's go in here. It's a Mercedes uh, Sprinter conversion, 697 centimeters in length. This is, I think, uh, the pièce de résistance. I'll take you around the back to start off with. You can see here. So you've got this storage here, gas. You've got storage there above the bed. One side there's not no storage, and the other side you've got storage exactly the same layout as I've meant to put into, or I mean to put in to my own uh, sprinter conversion. So I'm gonna come around here now. See if we get in this way. And uh, if I can work out how to get in here. There we go. The trouble with this is that other people then walk in and follow me in, you see. <laughs> okay, three chairs around the table. Fridge that opens both ways. Large toilet, obviously the carpet will come off this there to protect the floor. Door that lets you into the garage. Oven. No storage uh, on that side, but you do have the keeper. And you've got uh, storage on this side with tambour doors and a television above that. See that in another film. Yeah, you're probably wondering what that racket is. So I'll show you the I'll show you what the racket is. So in the hall we've got uh, okay space camper here. There's a bimobile, there's some Rymo campers. As you mentioned, the, uh, the sun. Here's a composting toilet. There's a way of turning a car into a camper. There's some off-road stuff, terra camper. This is where the racket is. It's this uh, idea of people coming to uh, sort of van life um, talks, compagna, to come next year, you might be able to hear me talk. Uh, flow camper. This is just a small corner of this room. all the campers in one place okay summer mobile La Strada camp mobile hey funny if I got lost wouldn't it while it's filming so this brings me back to where I started from we see how big this event is uh, today's a Friday and uh, uh, I think it'll get pretty busy later at the moment it's not too busy by by uh, standards from here okay so I'm coming back now thanks for watching this uh, video and here's the company and there's the van so uh, if you, 
do consider, I'll say no, no, do consider, do, uh, do, do subscribe and do consider giving some support on Patreon. Thanks for your assistance, uh, for those who assisted by watching uh, or commenting. And uh, so that's all for today. Not, well, at least for this video. Bye.